It's a shippy dippy. Now then, I already finished the second season. I'm not gonna give a proper review on it because it's just the same thing as the last the last anime review I did. The second season is pretty much the same thing. It acts like Higurashi and stuff. So I'm not gonna explain that. I'm gonna explain what I'm gonna do for the rest of the for the for the remainder of you know stuff left up. I'm still gonna do anime reviews. That's that's gonna be a non-negotiable thing. That's rule number one. Rule number two. I feel like more. I feel like doing more videos like I've been doing like the Naruto Uzumaki Chronicles game because of the fact that I'm not focused on the chat more so than I am on the video. I'd rather do those videos because of A, I can like, you know, c continue playing because usually when I do a live stream, I want to do different games. But with I'm playing, but when I'm doing a video on a, of, a, of a video game, I want to complete that video game before I move on to the next one. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm not going to, I'm still going to do live streams and stuff, but I mean, it's going to be more sporadic and I will be doing more and more videos like the Naruto Uzumaki Chronicles videos. If you guys want to keep watching it, that's fine. I'm not going to do anything. And also the fact that it will help me get more playlists out. Because just when I live stream, I get too fucking lazy of making a playlist of the video game itself. This way I can just like, you know, once it uploads, I can put it in the thing and stuff like that. So I'm getting, I have a playlist on my playlist. You just got to fucking find it. I mean, but. Like I said, I'm going to continue doing videos on my PlayStation 2. I'm not going to live stream any of them because it's too much of a hassle and I, I like the setup I have right now, okay? I don't fucking care what people say. I get great audio, stuff like that. The next video, though, of the Naruto Uzumaki Chronicles, which is part four, I'll tell you this much. It's a lot longer than the last two videos because of the fact that I decided to do three, three missions and the next mission is going to be a beer man mission. But here's the thing, okay? I'm going to try my best to not fail any mission. That's going to be harder than usual because I've at least failed at least a lot of missions back in the day. I've, I'm like a veteran on Naruto Uzumaki Chronicles and the game fucking... Apparently a lot of people fucking hate it. I don't hate it as much as people do. I just... I love playing Naruto games in the PlayStation 2. Um, now then, with that being said, once I complete Naruto Uzumaki Chronicles, I'm going jumping into the second game of the franchise, and after that game is completed, which, by the way, when I do do that game, I'm going to start a brand new, um, uh, I'm going to start a brand new save file, because I've already beaten the game twice or three times, and, and the fact that here's the problem with that. When I beat the game on Naruto Uzumaki Chronicles 2, I'm going to beat the story mode again. I will show you guys after I beat the boss again. And then after I beat the story mode twice, I'm going to do all the missions and all the survival arcs for most of the characters. So survival mode I would do with most of the characters. Some characters I can't do because some of them are really fucking tedious and I'd rather not deal with it. No offense. Choji's fucking broken. I know that. But. Here's the problem. With Naruto Uzumaki Chronicles 2. Your reason why I want to beat it twice. Is because I want to. Because most people just beat the story mode once. And they think that's it. No. Because you also have to deal with the missions. Which that should be easy enough. And you also have to deal with. um The survival mode. And also the fact that there's an. Kakashi Saga, and I'm going to show that off, but I have to beat the game twice, I believe. And also do all the missions to get that, and that what pisses me off about it. So, when I beat the game a second time, you only, the last thing you're going to see is probably a short video about it, on what you unlocked at the end of it, and you might... I'm going to show the final boss twice when I do do that. And that's the main issue. Because I, cause you do unlock two things. You unlock Sasuke and you also unlock something that pretty much makes Sasuke fucking broken. 
But after I'm done with that and do all the missions and this, that, and the other thing, I'm going to do the second playthrough of Naruto Uzumaki Chronicles 2 off camera because you guys don't want to see me play the game twice. And then I'm going to jump into the Xenosaga series with the Xenosaga 1 through 3. I'm going to get Xenosaga 3, hopefully. And then when I get Xenosaga 3, then I'll be good to go. Okay? I do have Xenosaga 1 and 2. And I'm going to try to do my best to get everything. I'm not going to guarantee it, but, you know, stuff like that. Also, when I do do Xenosaga 2, I might have to skip some of the cutscenes because it's scratched up the hell and that's not my fault that's the last owner so i'm not gonna but the game still runs it's you can still see it um it's perfectly fine i have no problem with it so yeah i will be doing xeno saga i want to do xeno saga because that franchise is like my favorite turn-based franchise of all time after that though hopefully we get to play the original time splitters and then we'll go back to Naruto from Ultimate Ninja 1, 2, and 4. If you guys want me to do Ultimate Ninja 3, I have no problem with it. That's up to you guys. Leave a comment section down below. And that's what I'm going to do. As for the live streams on the PlayStation 4, this is where it gets interesting. Um, I'm only going to stream on the weekends because I'd rather do PlayStation 2 games because I feel like that's my... That's my thing. I'm still going to do anime reviews because I'm almost done with an anime review. I'm almost done with the anime review. And that's what I'm going to do. So, so I'm going to be honest with you. I like, I like what I'm doing as a setup here. If you guys don't like it, that's fine. Um, just don't watch my videos. So, most of my videos are going to be 30 to f between 30 to 45 minutes long depending on... What missions I do and stuff like that. Some of the videos might be short depending on what I do. But yeah, some videos might be long, but they can't but the video that I make is only gonna be two hours long no matter what happens. So yeah. Um the other thing is is that I need to find out if I can premiere my videos just like Dragonfire used to do with the Berseria series. That I wanna do that too. But I don't know how to do that. So yeah, you guys are getting three videos today. I did a live stream of Tales of Asperia getting pissed off at it. But then I realized, I thought about it. I was like, no, I like this setup better. So you're going to get a video of me commentating over a video game for the PlayStation 2. And on the weekends, I'll be live streaming video games with maybe my buds, like J Jamie, Nikki, unless they're doing other stuff, which is perfectly fine. Or you might just have me live stream a video game that I don't know. If I do do a live stream, though, I will be making more videos on the PlayStation 2. Because to be frankly honest with you, the games on the PlayStation 2 right now, the Naruto Uzumaki Chronicles game I'm recording, I'm having fun with it. Most of the PlayStation 4 games, I've already played Death and Ears to it. I'd rather play this game. Okay? I'm a I'm an old school guy. So, in the future, you might get, um, I don't know, let's say, um, uh, you might get some Nintendo 64 games on my list. Like, Destruction Derby 64, or like, Sergeant Heroes 1 and 2. I could get that for the PlayStation 2, but I don't like the fucking cutscenes. No offense. The PlayStation 2 version of Sergeant Heroes is completely fucking different than the fucking Nintendo 64. Nintendo 64 all day. And the best thing about it is that when I do do that, I can just unplug the PlayStation 2 from my thing and plug in the Nintendo 64. We might do Mario Party. Who knows? We might do Mario Golf. I don't know, but the, it all depends on you guys. So I'm going to leave it up to you. Do you want me to live stream old school video games or you just rather see me play old video games on videos that are like 30 to 45 minutes long? Not like an hour, hour long because of the fact that doing an hour stream gets freaking tiring of doing it all the time. And I'd rather do this because... I know more about old school video games than any other French and then the new games. I don't fucking care about Call of Duty. I don't give a shit about this, that, and the other thing. I'd rather do something that makes me happy. So I'm going to continue to record video games on my PlayStation 2. 
And then I will do some streaming, but only on the weekends if I feel like it. If I don't we live stream on the weekends, that means I make, I'm make i going to make a video of a video game on the PlayStation 2. Because I'm actually having fun with it. So, I hope you guys have a nice positive day. Um... Before I end this video, the anime that I the anime that I just watched, it's pretty much the same thing. It's just that it's really really ridiculous. Although I have noticed that that the anime that I that I, I have watched the second season of, um, it's like the same thing. It's just that the plot summary is in the same time zone time frame as the first season. It's just that different stuff happened during the that season with that being said though it it's pretty funny but some of the scenes in the first first second season and the first season there are a lot there are a lot of them um, scenes where they're not like talking as much but i tell you this much they have a third season come out and if and if it's all and if it's good i'll bump it up to an eight okay but it's still going to get a seven even though there's the third season coming out okay so I'll, that's where I'm stand on that anime. The anime I'm watching right now is a workout anime, and it's and it's. I'll explain that when I get to it. So the next video you might see of me just talking to you guys, it's gonna be an anime review again because I'm actually fucking happy of what I'm doing with the PlayStation Two. If you don't like me live streaming any, if you guys want me to stream, live stream anymore, just catch me on the weekends. That's what my that's where I'm gonna stop there. Okay, stay positive, everyone. I'm going back to my anime, and hopefully, I can get finish it beforehand so I can make a video about it. Um, before I go though, there's one other thing: the video about the Naruto game of the next next three four missions actually will be up tomorrow. Um, it's longer because the fourth mission fucking sucks. Fucking assholes. Make me fucking do the same shit over again. So yeah, I hope you guys have a nice positive day. Take care. I'm sorry I flipped you off. Stay positive, everyone. Peace.